Huh? It's dead. That's an odd way to die. Why is it blocking? <coughs> it died on its feet. Like it was trying to protect the cave behind it. It was a mama. They're... They're cubs. But it looks like they've been dead for a long time. That new must not have realized they were dead and kept on bringing food back for them. Oh. Boy, it wasn't too bright, was it? I mean, its cubs were already dead. Boy, if this doesn't beat all, sheesh. Oh, poor thing. Interesting how it can make you feel for just a simple creature, huh? Well. Looks like if you jump in, the current will carry you out. Do you want to jump? Yes. Bunion. So, how does it feel to do some real work for a change, hmm? When spring comes, the animals will return and life will get a little easier. You all did a good job. Congratulations. Wait a minute. You knew the new was only hunting for food for her cubs. And you still had us kill her? If you had known she had cubs, would you have let her live? And so, spring came at last. Spring came to the mountain and to the woods and to their inhabitants. Virtue of the young boys who saved the village from the ferocious new chimera. Earned them a place in the villagers' hearts. I'm home! I went to the West Woods looking for animals and berries. And look what I found! Now we won't have to worry about food! Anymore, right, Ray? It's a good thing we got rid of that monster, huh? I suppose so. Hey! 
Why don't we go down to the village and show them who did it? Tell them who got rid of the monster. Hmm. I don't know. Isn't it better if we don't brag about it? <laughs> Rio is looking pretty tempted by those apples. <laughs> uh, why is that? But I suppose it wouldn't hurt to go see what they're saying about us, would it? Then we can go? Come on, come on! <laughs> so much for the apples, huh? And still controlling Depot. Uh, no, I want to go the other way. I'm also tempted by that chest it taunted me at. I'm gonna go look at it. Oh, encounter. became level 7. <laughs> Not bad. Okay. Let's go see that chest. Won't let me. Oh well. Oh, another encounter. Bunyan's home. <laughs> hmm. Guess that chest is in a different part of the forest. Well, I'll look for it later. to the world map. A random encounter there. It's nice seeing a little spring feel to it. McNeil, huh. Oh, my neck is stiff. Had my head in one position for too long. Funny, no one's here. I told everyone we'd be coming into town today. What? I knew you were bragging. I knew it. <laughs> hmm? Uh oh. Hey, Tipo, what's going on? Hey, Ray. Is it true what they say? That you three killed the new? Well, uh, yeah. So what Bunyan was saying is true, then? So me, you mean you risk your lives? For us? 
I guess you could say that. Well done! <laughs> Looks like we misjudged you boys. We're sorry, and we're grateful. We certainly are! If we'd known what you were really like before, well then. <laughs> you won't need to steal anything ever again. We'll give you food whenever you need it, just ask. <laughs> Doesn't that just beat all? You'd better not steal anything, mister. What do you think of that? We're heroes. I don't know about you, but I feel pretty important. I think we're just in this walk pattern. I think we're just in the middle of his walk pattern. <laughs> you guys are something. I'm really impressed. No, I mean it. I am. Me? My name is Loki. I guess you guys are heroes, eh? Save the village, yeah? Yep, you three are certainly heroes. Yep, yes indeed. Yep, you're really something. I mean, you killed that new. Something no one else was able to do. That's why. Seeing as you're so strong, I wanted to ask for your help. Really? I guess so. Though I wouldn't want to trust someone named Loki, since we all know Norse mythology. Or is it Greek? No, it's Norse. Oh, you'll help me? I just knew you would. Down the road, there's a farm with a little hut on the roadside. I'll meet you there later, okay? Then we have a deal. Okay, so I know what the place he's talking about. Anyways, shop! Yeah, you want some weapons? What are you gonna do after next? Hear the disc loading. Let's see, can I get anything new? I could go with the bronze sword. We'd bring our attack up, and I think for Rio that would be a good idea. So we'll get one bronze sword. Yes. And yes, we'll equip it to Rio. There we go. Huh, so Ray's already wearing leather armor, huh? Drop her agility down, though. Bracers... Really? The cloth shield would actually bring up Ray's defense? Huh, who knew? A brass helmet. Man, a lot of these defense items really drop your speed. For now, I'll just buy another bandana for Ray. There we go. Well, that's all I'll get here. Let's see what I can get for items. <laughs> oh, a special rate, huh? Chance of restoring status, poison. Blindless. I'm gonna buy a couple of these. Wrong direction! Flame attack versus one target. Molotov. Ammonia, huh? Ammonia revives a party member? I'm gonna get a couple of these. Use when fishing. Why not? I'll grab one. And... I guess I'll grab a couple worms. Now let's see what I can sell that I'm not going to use. May as well. <laughs> Appears valuable and it's only 5 zenny. We'll sell Bunyan's plate, why not? Freeze up our inventory. And not anything else really to sell. Well, I feel I've made good use of my money and I am switching characters back to Rio because for some reason it feels weird controlling Tipo. We can roam around town, though.
I really should see if there's an accessory shop anywhere. Hmm. <laughs> Look at that, their crops are plentiful this year. That's good. And the music's all happy and cheery. And this must be the hut he's talking about. For now, though, I just want to save. This way to Ural Road. For now, world map and camping to save. I feel I've gone for a good while. Camp right here. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Interact with the book, please. Thank you. A little rest. Even though we didn't really take much damage or use anything. And we'll save. Hmm. Yep, right here I'll do. There we go, save successful. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Breath of Fire 3. This is Autumn Child saying, I'll see you all next time.